So, a big win by the Toronto Maple Leafs tonight. How do you feel about that start, especially with Ryan O'Reilly getting his first two goals as a Maple Leaf? No, oh, O'Reilly played great tonight. Yeah, he, uh, phenomenal getting that hat trick, you know, two goals on his first two shots, almost scored on his first three. You know, he worked hard. He worked hard, just like me on this bike post-game. Because uh, that's what you have to do after a big win when you almost cost, uh, you know, oh, give up the lead again. But uh, Ryan played great. His line played awesome. Um, I'm really proud of him. And uh, yeah, getting the full Leafs treatment. I feel Ryan. Three goals, last one. Barely goes in, but hey, nice little backhand there. Uh, backhand move to put it in. One timer from Marner. Marner loves feeding Ryan O'Reilly. Good, keep it up. Hey, he couldn't score in St. Louis, but he can score with Toronto. Yeah, you're right. It was a it was it was a great uh, great start by them and John Tavares and all his points tonight. Uh, do you think uh, he's enjoying being a left winger? And then John Tavares, yeah, he's he's the answer to left wing. He was the answer to John Tavares' left wing, wasn't he? Uh, he scores tonight. He gets a couple assists in there. I think he gets four points. Obviously, it was that amazing start. He's celebrating, big smile when O'Reilly got the uh, empty netter there to win six three. He's the captain. He showed it again, and uh, oh yeah, well, just phenomenal effort by him and uh, and everyone else. And Mitch Marner, thoughts on him? Oh, Mitch Marner, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mitchy did his thing. How many points he get tonight? Four, five. Did he even get an assist? On, he got an assist on the O'Reilly third one, right? So did he assist on all three? I think he should have gotten an assist on. Uh, on Nylander's goal there, too, that John Tavares assisted on. That was a great play by him. Uh, Mitch Marner's just finding his teammates. He got a little bit upset looking at Mike Johnson's uh, iPad there or video, whatever, when he showed him when he just missed that pass to Ryan O'Reilly to get the hat trick. But he was looking for him tonight. He, he was he was Mitchy Marner on offense. He was getting back. He was uh, taking men out. Uh, phenomenal effort by him, as always. And uh, it's nice to see he's, it's just working. There was some rumblings that Ilya Samsonov was ill. He had a, a stomach bug last game against Chicago. Maybe he shouldn't have started. What were your thoughts on his play tonight? Uh, Samsonov looked good in the first period because he barely saw anything. Looked good in the second when Buffalo put, poured it on because let's be honest. Toronto played well and dominated play for about 12 minutes of that game. That was the first period. Then William Nealer got that power play goal in the second period. Uh, Samsonov played well, and then he didn't. Um, the Quinn goal, that was a beautiful shot, to be fair, and I think it was a bad play by Timmins. And then Morgan Riley, I don't know what that turned around. That was like, you know, a rookie trying to, a rookie in the OHL, a rookie in AAA trying to turn there to stop Tuck, but that was a great goal um, on Samsonov. Uh, yeah, he did play the near post a little bit too much, but hey, what you going to do, right? Um and then Skinner scores short side the other side. So that's two goals on the block or one on the glove. Samsonov could have played better. Maybe he still has stomach issues. I don't understand why he played against Chicago. Maybe he felt better tonight. He wanted to get the win. Hey, he got the win. So we'll take it. Um, yeah, so Ilya did all right. And I guess overall, what do you think of the whole game? What do you think of the Leafs? Losing to Chicago? Destroying Buffalo? What do you think about that second period up until the William Nylander goal? Overall, my thoughts, uh, you know, good first 12 to 15 minutes, and then Buffalo, ah, good first period, sure. And then Buffalo takes to them in the second period, definitely take it to them in the third, make a game of it. Leafs win by three, but it was a little bit uh, testy there. Uh, uh, can't really feel comfortable being a Leafs fan, can you? That's why we have trust issues. It is a roller coaster of emotions with this Leafs team. So with everything being said, where do you think the Leafs are at now? What do they do next? Trade deadline is literally hours away. Thoughts? Um, but I like the lineup. Defense, I don't see Timmins playing really in the playoffs. Um, he's just a good guy to have in that like eighth role. And I'm not going to lie, we might see Sandine in the seventh if they can make a trade. If I'm going to make a trade, <clears throat> Nick Jensen. From Washington, maybe pair him up with Riley. Figure out someone can other than Brody. So you don't want Riley on the shutdown role. Do you? <laughs> Not a chance. So maybe like Brody and Hall together. Lily and Geo. Lily dominated Tage Thompson tonight. Watching him uh, 
Tace Thompson trying to go wide. Boom. Going around the other way. Boom. Um, I think Sandine deserves to be in the lineup, but I think they try to find someone who can play with Riley. <clears throat> that's the only thing. That's the only reason I think he'd be he'd be out of the lineup. Um, what else do we got there? Oh, I do love Achari. Uh, even if he doesn't get to the puck first, he's making sure the guy remembers that he's on his ass because uh, he's hitting everyone, and it, it feels great. That fourth line looks great. Third line played a lot better. Matthews, oh, I thought he was going to score a few. Uh, it was nice to see Willie score because that second period, he was one of the ones where I'm like, oh, he's taking the rest of the game off. Um, and then that first line was phenomenal. So overall, I think the Leafs just need to find a defensive partner for Morgan Riley. He's a bit of a liability at times. Offensively, you saw the pass to Michael Bunting. It's a beautiful goal, that fourth goal. Uh, great read by Bunting to leave the zone uh, and just go, oh, we're getting the puck. I'm going. And Morgan Riley, a little sauce, breakaway, hold, goal. Boom, Anderson, you come in, you try your, your hand at it. And Anderson played really well, to be honest with you. Um, yeah, so offensively, Riley's good, but defensively, big time liability. And Justin Hall, not bad. Just play like you're on the penalty kill, Justin Hall, and that's what you'll be doing because you'll be a shutdown with uh, TJ Brody, who loves to jump up in the play. But yeah, uh, Leafs win. I'm happy, and uh, I guess this workout's done because the Leafs work is done. They win 6 3 against Buffalo. Anything else you'd like to say before we go? Oh, what else do I have to say? <laughs> Easy. Go loose, go.